everyone here, Chantelle from Belly Sense, um, your independent sensory consultant from New Zealand. Um, I just thought I'd pop on here. I've got a quite a big haul this month. Right. The box is absolutely massive. Um, and it also contains the Region 3 March with, bo with box. So I'm super excited. This is the first one I have ever received. So... And I've been trying so hard not to look at any videos at all, even the ones in different regions. Um, most of the time it is different, but I just didn't want to um, ruin anything just in case. So I'll be opening that um, for the last part just to, you know, get myself excited and amped up for it. Uh, so I will start off with um, some of the items that we have for some customers. Um, we have a Jammy Time washer with. Um, I actually picked up one of these for myself as well because I wanted to try it because I've been using pink cotton for the linen and the black raspberry vanilla for my clothes and things like that. And um, I really wanted to give Jammy Time a go. Just another little smell. Yeah, I think that one's going to be really, really nice. Super strong. Apparently, Jammy Time and um, the clothesline, the laundry sense of these, are one of the strongest. So I'm super excited to give those a go. Might become a new favorite. Pink Cotton's um, one of my faves at the moment. So um, definitely be excited to give that one a go. Um, she, uh, my, this customer ordered the three-pack of the little washer with. So she got one in black raspberry vanilla. One in jammy time, like I already just showed you, and the other one in Amazon Rain. So, she is new to the washer with, so I kind of advised her that it would be best to get the little three pack um, of the 454 gram little containers, just to give them a go, see what one she likes first before committing to the big tubs. That's the way that I would um, want to do it anyway, if it was me. And purchasing them for the first time. Um, one of my customers, I'll just dig them out. Hmm, where's the last one? It must be hiding. Oh, there it is. She wanted some car bars, so she got a three pack. Uh, one aloe water and cucumber. This is a really, really nice, fresh, um, yeah, refreshing scent. Um, so she wanted one of those. She, her mum works with me, um, and she jumped in her car and got extremely jealous of this one and wondered why her mum didn't get her any. So she was in the bandwagon straight away. Trying to get hold of some of those. She also got the white tea and cactus. And the lovely lychee. Which this one is really, really nice. So hopefully she'll be excited to receive those ones. We also got... My cousin wanted the a warmer. Um, so she got the poised warmer. I don't know if you can see that on there. The design I will open it because I also got a matching one for my kitchen um, I have one here in my open plan living area but it's not quite enough for my um, to go all the way down the hallway and into the kitchen and things so I wanted one in the kitchen so I also got one me and my cousin are exactly the same and we don't make decisions very easily um, so we were kind of every time we'd ask one if we liked the other one uh, I like to warm her. It would always be, I don't know, do you? Um, so yeah, we settled on poise, but it took pretty much all month to make that decision there. Um, so I actually have one. I opened it up for you. Just so I could show you what it was like. Instead of trying to open it like I did last time and making a big mess and taking my time. So um, this is the poise warm here. It is really nice it's like a ceramic feel to it and it's also got that um type of base to it like the base look which i really like um and then it has a, a 
just kind of started melting some wax in there. Um, it's kind of like a misted or foggy glass to it, which I really like. Um, and that is a has a number four in it, so um, suggested by Sensi not to go over four cubes of wax in there, otherwise it will overflow, which we don't want. Um, I'll turn that one on. I think this one is beautiful on. Um, so it glows and then the light just shines through these little little diamonds here. Really, really pretty. So yeah, I think my cousin will love that. This is her first ever warmer. Um, this one here is a 20 watt warmer. And the light bulb kind of ends just here so it is quite close to the um, dish so even though it's only 20 watts I think it will perform really really well so that is the poised warmer um, this one here will match any kind of decor as well so yeah in my kitchen it just it does look really really nice What other goodies did we get? For her first waxes, my cousin also got the clothesline. This one is great if you are wanting to do a spring clean. Um, super strong, this one's a powerhouse, so it will um, just last, and it lasts forever as well. So that one is a good staple wax bar. Coconut lemongrass, really, really nice as well. Um, I get migraines really easy. This one is a powerhouse and it just didn't work very well with me. Um, but my mum and my sister-in-law love the scent. Um, and I know lots of other people that do as well. Um, just wasn't great for my migraines there, unfortunately. Amazon Rain is a really, really nice one as well. I'll just bring up these scent notes. Sweet notes of lemon, orange zest, coconut milk, and sultry night blooming jasmine. So this one is really nice. It's a powerhouse as well, so it will just um, be really good in open plan living areas as well as bedrooms. Um, yeah, really, really nice. And this one lasts a long, long time. This is why I don't have my little sidekick here today. Um, she is currently um, in her cot. I'm trying to give her a nap. And so I thought, while I'm trying to do that, probably with no success, um, I will show you guys this. I got her the Bailey the Bunny. Um, comes in this gorgeous little box. Um, you can actually, um, it's got a little cutout for some handles because um, kids love to hold things and put things away in little cubbies. Um, so she will absolutely love the, that, his little home. So I'm excited to say I got this for her Easter because she has a condition, um, it's called a cynophilic esophagitis. Um, so she can't eat lots of things, it's where your body attacks food going down the esophagus um, and causes all sorts of kind of sore throat and uh, yeah, it's not very nice, so um, she can't eat a lot of things. Um, she's mostly still formula fed, even though she is only, she's still, she's almost three. So I thought this would be a awesome present, um, because I think she'll get a bit upset this year now that she knows what Easter is all about. And her sister will be getting chocolate, so this will be a good distraction. Oh my gosh, guys, he is so soft. Oh, I love this. This is the first buddy that I've brought so he is super soft and he's got the little Scentsy trademark with the corgi material and on the bottom as well super super soft so with these ones he's got a little zip in his back which hopefully she won't notice if I put the scent pack in there myself um, because she has a habit of just taking out things. She had a little Lula doll that you put the little sound box and it would do the breathing as if like you were co-sleeping with them and she just got obsessed with taking it out. So just in here you pop your little scent pack and then you close him back up 
and then the scent pack just goes through so she can smell him. Oh, I love this. This is actually adorable. I think she'll be so happy with that. I don't know if you guys can see how soft he is. Gorgeous. So this will be going back away until Easter. Super, super cute. Okay, very happy with that one. Put him back. There you go. I got her to go with that, the Berry Bright um, scent pack. This one is actually one of her favorites. I'll bring up the scent notes. She always loves this one um, in the tester. I don't actually have a bar of it. I need to get one for her room as well. This one is Blue Raspberry Flesh Clementine um, with Sugar Plum. It's a sweet sugar plum. So, yeah, this one is super, like, very sweet berry scent. Gorgeous. So, that one will be perfect. I might even put it in there beforehand. So, when she gets it out straight away, she smells... Um, just like the Berry Bright scent pack. Apparently it can take a few hours to get through. So yeah, I think I'll do that a couple of days beforehand. Right. I think that leads us on to the whiff box. Exciting. So like I said, I have never had one of these before. So in New Zealand, these are $55, but you always get more in the box than what you pay for it and if you do the um if you do the the scentsy club um if you spend over a certain amount you get a half price item lots of people use the whiff box um or a big tub of washer whiffs for that half price item so that's a really good way to do it also um, with the Sensi Club, you get 10% off if you go over Saturday as well. I think that is $30 in New Zealand. Um, super excited. This box took such a long time to get here. I ordered this one on the 1st of March. And then it didn't get sent out until the 12th of March. So, um, and now we're on the 16th. So it takes a long time to get to New Zealand. Here we go. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I see a cleaning product. That's so good. I've just gotten into all the cleaning products, so <laughs> I'm really excited to try them all out. So this is what it looks like. It's got some nice kind of purple stuff, purple paper to go in there to make it look all nice. So this one is Good Clean Fun. So um, it comes with a little paper just so it gives you an idea on what it's all about. And this one says, who says cleaning needs to be boring? If you're not the type to get excited about vacuuming and organizing, you're not alone. So let's mix things up and have a little fun. Cut out these cards to throw them in a box or jar and make a game out of cleaning. It's your house, so you make the rules. So on here, it's got a chores list. This is super cute. So you cut out these little squares and put them in a jar and pick them out. So this one's tidy as much as you can in 15 minutes. Trade cards with someone or draw it again. Competition time, whoever cleans their room the fastest wins. Oh, this is awesome. I will play a little game with my 13 year old. She hates cleaning. She doesn't do anything at the moment. She's a little bit of her and she just sits in her room all day. So that'd be cool. I probably will actually cut those out and do that one. Oh, wow. Oh, cool. It's a dishcloth. They gave me a dishcloth, guys. How cute. Oh, yay. I'm excited. That is so cool. It's got little lemon prints. That's awesome. Okay, so first off, they gave me a pink sugarberry mint wax bar. This is the March scent of the month. Um... Hold on a second, guys. This is a very small area that I'm in. I will just bring up those scent notes there before I smell it. Do do do. Here we go. I'm just on the laptop. Um, I'm not very organized. I just got this, and I only have about maybe 15 minutes, 15, 20 minutes before I, she loses the plot in her room if she doesn't fall asleep. 
Um, so the Pink Sugarberry Mint, uh, the March scent of the month, is Plump Raspberry. It's delightfully dusted with sugar and the sweetest hint of peppermint. So it's a nice kind of bubblegum pink wax bar there. Ooh. Yeah, I love this. This one is definitely going to have to go on my club. Um, I don't get much mint. I bet it kind of just adds a maybe a cooling, a wax clean effect just after, at the end. But yeah, that one's really, really nice. Definitely like a um, sugary, raspberry, strawberry, berry type scent. Really, really nice. I can't wait to um, warm this one. I might just swap out my daughter's room's one. Give that a go today. Exciting. Definitely going to go on my club. Hopefully it's a powerhouse because this one I can see being my favorite. Really, really nice. Pop that one there. And then we got a counter clean. This is really good. I just tried out the... Um, Perfect Peppermint Counter Clean, um, and it actually, oh, it's so nice, you spray it on. What I do to not waste it, I wipe down all my benches um, with the water and the, you know, the hot water and the soap, um, get rid of any dirt, and then I spray it and wipe it again with the Counter Clean, and it goes for ages in the scent. You can smell it for a long time afterwards. Um, I hope I say this right. Um, this one is in the Counter Clean Lemon verbena oh i'm not very good um and let's see uh, okay oh that's not gone up lemon lemon verbena verbena someone will have to correct me on how to say this properly um Lemon zest, lime, and ver verbena leaf. So I'll be very excited to give that one a go. It also came with Fiesta Lime dish soap. I have not tried the dish soaps, so I'll be very, very excited to give that one a go. These are full-size products as well, guys. This is awesome. And Squeeze the Day Bathroom Cleaner. Squeeze the Day has got to be one of my favorite scents as well. Um, in the testers, I haven't actually got it in the bar yet. I had the um, scent circle in my car and it is super, super nice and strong. So I cannot wait to give that one a go in the bathroom cleaner. And I have heard that the bathroom cleaner is very, very good. Really exciting. And the best part about the whiff boxes is most of the time, you get a, um, a little scent pod and it has probably maybe two cubes worth of the ne um, next month's scent of the month. So, oh gosh, another one that I probably won't be able to say. Plum, plum Brianna, Brina, Plum Brina Peach. So, I don't know. They didn't give me a scent note. Mmm, this one. Another berry scent. I love the berry scents at the moment. This one's really nice, actually. You can definitely smell the peach. Yeah, I like that one. I'll try bring it up, but I don't think it will show anything, guys. Plumbrina. Sombria peach. That is actually a fruit we obviously don't have in New Zealand. Um, ripe pineapple and luscious peach blend sweetly over a bit of blooming plumbria. Yeah, it definitely does have 
I can smell the pineapple definitely. Yeah, I think that um, I will be getting one of these. This one is really, really nice. Um, can't wait to give that one a go. So hopefully I will be able to um, see what it's like and get it in the next month's one. And if you were humming and hiring about the pink sugarberry mint, definitely give it a go. This one is so nice. So everyone, that is it for today. Thank you for watching my haul. Sorry, it took a bit of a long video to get there. Um, I should have been a bit organized with all the sent notes and things like that. But as I said, I didn't have quite enough time in between getting the baby down for a nap. And then also we've got a real estate agent coming. Um, and that's another thing I was going to say as well. Um, I have been using the Scentsy Fresh as well. I've got my warmers on um, and also the Peppermint Counter Clean. Um, so that is probably going to make a huge difference. Hopefully she loves it when she walks in. Nice and cozy for her. And um, yeah, just if you have stuff like that, I think that Scentsy is perfect to kind of show your house. If you know what I mean. In New Zealand it's quite a, um, like... Houses are going for crazy at the moment. Uh, you're talking like a million dollars for a normal three or four bedroom house in an area that wasn't worth, no one wanted to move to a little while, like three years ago. When we moved, people thought we were crazy moving out these ways. So uh, yeah, it's a bit depressing at the moment trying to upgrade your house. But since he makes it, you know, a little bit more fun while you're trying to get things ready for that. Um, so that was all for today. Um, if you guys wanted to visit my site, it's just valleyscent.scentsy.co.nz um, and then Facebook is Scents in the Valley um, and or for the Instagram, Valley Scent. Um, so it was nice talking to you all on this gloomy, wet, horrible day. I hope you all have a great week and see you next time. Bye.